Welcome to Era Shapers. Today we delve into the remarkable story of a man who not only created Germany but also shaped the course of world history. Enter Otto von Bismarck, the architect of German unification. Born into Prussian nobility in the year 1815, Bismarck was bred for a life of power and influence. His education, steeped in the classics and philosophy, nurtured a formidable intellect, preparing him for a career in the civil service. Yet Bismarck was not content to merely serve. He sought to shape, to lead. His political career began modestly enough as a representative of Prussia in the German Confederation. But this was merely a stepping stone, a taste of the political arena that would soon become his battleground. Little did the world know, this Prussian nobleman was on the threshold of a journey that would redefine the map of Europe. Bismarck's journey to power wasn't without challenges, but his strategic brilliance and diplomatic prowess were about to change the course of German history. Appointed as the Prime Minister of Prussia in 1862, Bismarck was not merely content with maintaining the status quo, he had a grander vision to fortify Prussian power and bring the disparate German states under one flag. His policy of blood and iron was a testament to his unshakable resolve. It was a pivotal strategy, one that understood the necessity of war and industrial might in achieving political ends. Bismarck was about to navigate a complex European political landscape where alliances were as fluid as they were fragile. First on his agenda was the Danish War of 1864. This conflict, seemingly minor in the grand scheme of European politics, was actually a stepping stone for Prussia. It established the nation's military prowess and set the stage for a more significant conflict, the Austro-Prussian War of 1866. This war, swift and decisive, ousted Austria from German affairs and established Prussia as the dominant German power. But the final piece of Bismarck's unification puzzle was yet to come. The Franco-Prussian War of 1870-71, to a masterstroke of diplomacy and strategy, not only led to the formation of a unified Germany, but also significantly altered the balance of power in Europe. Through wars and alliances, Bismarck was steadily paving the way for a single, powerful German nation. In 1871, Bismarck's vision became a reality, forever changing the political landscape of Europe. In the Grand Hall of Versailles, amidst the backdrop of the Franco-Prussian War, the German Empire was proclaimed with Bismarck appointed as its first chancellor. The unification of Germany was no easy feat. It was the culmination of Bismarck's shrewd diplomacy and strategic alliances. He masterfully maneuvered through the intricate web of European politics, outplaying larger, more powerful nations. Through wars and treaties, Bismarck had managed to consolidate the fragmented German states into a single formidable empire. As Chancellor, Bismarck's influence on the newly unified Germany was profound. He implemented policies that modernized the country's economy, strengthened its military, and established social welfare programs that were ahead of their time. He deftly balanced the competing interests of the powerful Prussian aristocracy and the emerging industrial class, ensuring stability and prosperity for the young nation. Bismarck's policies not only unified Germany, but they also shifted the balance of power in Europe. The birth of this new Central European power disrupted the delicate equilibrium that had been maintained since the Congress of Vienna in 1815. Bismarck's tenacity and strategic brilliance had given birth to a nation that would become a major player on the global stage. His legacy as the Iron Chancellor and the architect of modern Germany remains etched in the annals of history, a testament to his political genius and indomitable will. Bismarck's journey was a testament to the immense power of strategic leadership and political acumen. His legacy, both in Germany and globally, is indisputable. After a remarkable career, Bismarck was dismissed from office in 1890, but his influence didn't end there. In the world of politics, Bismarck's strategies and diplomatic tactics are still studied and admired today. His ability to navigate the choppy waters of European politics, to forge alliances and outwit rivals, was nothing short of masterful. His vision for a unified Germany, born out of a complex tapestry of wars and alliances, changed the face of Europe and the world at large. Bismarck's legacy is not just the unified Germany he left behind, but the enduring lessons of strategic statecraft and leadership that continue to inspire. Otto von Bismarck, the Iron Chancellor, 
masterfully steered the course of history, leaving a legacy that continues to resonate in the corridors of global politics. Don't forget to subscribe to stay updated on our newest videos, where we uncover the legacies of those who shaped our world.